response to the conflict between Russia and Ukraine, the Secretary of Defense is deploying thousands of Fort Stewart soldiers to Europe. And as our Brooke Butler reports, their deployment has left many in the Hinesville community feeling unsettled. Nearly 4,000 Fort Stewart soldiers are headed to Germany amid Russia's invasion of Ukraine. And some local veterans tell me they're not exactly on board with this move. I think personally that the European Union, the NATO people, they need to take care of themselves. Our involvement should be very limited there, in my opinion. Veterans in the Hinesville area worry sending our troops to Germany isn't the right move. For me, it all depends on how they do it. I don't think we're the world's police. I think NATO needs to fess up and they need to secure their own backyard. And we just be back up if they can't do it. They're not the only ones who are worried. Anka Hinzi, a Hinesville restaurant owner who's from Germany, says she fears the conflict in Ukraine will spill over into her home country. There's only one country in between my home country. I tell the people here it's kind of like Georgia and Alabama going to a war. And Arkansas is like, oh, that's far away. It's not really that far away. Well, the president said no soldiers will be engaging in the conflict between Russia and Ukraine and will only be reassuring NATO allies and helping them to repair, Anka and others still fear for those being deployed. We are worried about our soldiers. Just pray for everybody. Now, they're encouraging everyone to support the Hinesville community, as many of the people who live here are family members of those being sent overseas. We need to make sure the spouses and everybody else left in the left behind here are well taken care of. It's simple as that. That's our obligation as a community. Yeah, especially a military community. Now these Fort Stewart soldiers are going to be joining the 80,000 troops already stationed in Europe. Reporting in Hinesville, I'm Brooke Butler, WJCL 22 News.